ITV's boss Kevin Ligo has said he has handed over his own phone to investigators looking at the channel's handling of the Philip Schofield scandal. The head of entertainment said the external team had looked through his emails, texts, and WhatsApps. It follows reports of a toxic culture backstage on this morning, which rocked the Daily Show after Philip acknowledged to having an affair with a young runner. Kevin remarked during the Edinburgh TV Festival, when it all flared up, we thought, are there things we don't know about? What's been going on? There are some things we need to know. There were rumors and everything flying around, and we thought, we need to get to the bottom of what's going on. So we ordered an independent investigation, and she has been looking into it and talking to everyone involved. They take your phone and go through every text, email, and WhatsApp message you've ever sent. On a brighter note, he joked about what his private texts might include. He said that he could have declined to cooperate on the grounds of privacy. He then joked that he didn't want the report to read. This isn't the full report because Kevin Ligo wouldn't give us his phone. Kevin said, So everything is available, lots of interviews, everything is possible. Ligo predicted that the investigation's report will be available in September. However, he emphasized the importance of patience. He stated, The most important thing is to get facts and truth, not a hasty judgment. There's a lot of pressure these days from the press and social media saying, You've got to decide, and why didn't you fire him? And you just think, Well, hang on a minute, we have no idea what the truth is yet. Ligo stated that the network will act accordingly once the investigators' findings are revealed. In late May, the commercial broadcaster hired Jane Mulkey Casey to investigate Schofield's relationship with a considerably younger runner. Some have proposed that a cross-broadcaster initiative to monitor presenter behavior might improve the business as a whole, but Kevin says such projects tend to get bogged down. He stated that ITV had learned from Love Island saying, we have guidelines for producers, and it's defined what we expect from them in this area of work, so believe me, we take it incredibly seriously whatsoever.